it's your girl Kayla here. I know I look a little crazy right now. My hair has poofed out because right now I am in Columbus, Georgia. And today I thought it would be really fun to take you guys along with me as I go to look at manufactured and mobile modular homes. I'm really excited because I want to keep my options open and just kind of see what's out there and what my options are. Um, so I'm excited to show you guys all the cute properties that I saw today. I'm filming this intro last. At this time, I've already seen all the properties. I'm hot, y'all. I'm sweating, as you can see. And I, I'm shook. And you guys are going to be shook, too. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Make sure you like this video. Give it a thumbs up. And I um, also just want to say thank you guys so much for subscribing to me. Y'all showed me so much support on my last video, and I want to thank you guys so, so much. We're almost at 2K subbies, and I hope you guys like this video. Let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, we're about to go inside of this one. Okay, we are inside, and this is what it's looking like. I mean, I did not expect for this to be so huge. This humongous island. It's crazy. I mean, all the space you get is amazing. And this trailer is going for $105,000. Coming this way, you have a bedroom. Ooh, this must be the master. This is luxurious. I don't care what nobody say. This is very luxury. I mean, eight people could fit in this shower. It's a private toilet. And then your own, oh my gosh. Your own walk-in closet. Do you guys see how big this is? I mean, whoa. And this is just the master suite. I'm really impressed by this. Okay. And so coming to this side of the house, and they decorated it for Christmas, you can kind of see here like how it splits in half. So they have to, you know, put it together. But this is one bedroom. And you can already see how big it is in here. Let's look at this closet. Pretty good size, and I apologize for the lighting. There is the electricity is not on in any of these trailers. Here is the bathroom. Wow, this is really really nice, you guys. You get a lot of space for you for your for your bug. I don't know what they're doing here, but oh my gosh, this closet is huge. So we have three bedrooms, two full baths. What do you guys think? This is trailer number one. I'm not even sorry, you're gonna be the lonely one. Ooh. I'm in a better place. Cause they are back to back to each other. So I can't give you guys um, a view from far away. But let's go on inside. Oh my goodness, were any of you guys expecting this on the inside? This thing is massive. Look at the island. Wow, the sliding door. And this fireplace is so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, there's more stuff this way, y'all. This must be the master back here, or no? It's not, it's a little bedroom here. Bathroom. A little bedroom with closet. Oh my gosh, this is phenomenal. I'm impressed. So let's look at this price. Oh my goodness, only $89,000. This one is called Bougie. That's so cute. Wow, I like bougie. 
They probably do. Oh, so this is the washer and dryer. I don't remember seeing this in the last one. And this is cute, these little built-ins here. And this must be the master. Wow. This is tons of space. I mean, talk about spacious. Oh my gosh, wow. Oh my goodness, you guys. I guess like I'm just so impressed because I've never really been inside of a mobile home before ever. And I'm just impressed by like the quality, not only the quality, but just like everything. This is wonderful. Wow. Do you guys see this? I wish the lighting was better so you guys could get a better look, but. Oh my gosh. This is phenomenal. Did I show y'all the shower? Oh yeah. Now this one, like I mentioned before, is called Bougie and it's $89,000. And to me, this one is much nicer than the last one. What do you guys think? This is the next one. Oh, right? Okay. All right, walking right in and this is what you see. This one isn't too bad. All right, let's take a look at this price real quick. This one is $49,000, three bedrooms, two baths, 901 square feet. I kind of like this kitchen, I'm not gonna lie. This kitchen is nice, this is a nice little space. Yeah, so the other um, trailers we've been looking at, they were double. This one is, oh, don't look at that. But this one is singular, you guys. This is the master back here. Let's check out this bathroom. Okay. Okay, okay. All right. Not too bad, not too bad for the price. I mean, what do you expect? Cute. Really spacious. I like it. Come out this way, you have your washer and dryer again. All right, so when you walk in the front door, if you go this way, it's the other bedrooms. Look at the little thing. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is another little bedroom. Wow, this bedroom is too tiny. It's too tiny. And then we have another one. Another bathroom. And then the last room, which is also really tiny. Okay. And the flooring is pretty nice. Yeah. All right, here is the next one. I personally really like how it looks on the outside. It's really cute. So we're gonna go inside and see what this one is talking about. All right, first impressions. No, I'm not really feeling this one, but I guess your entertainment center would go right there, your TV, couch. Come along this way. Have the kitchen, the kitchen is quite nice. This one is going for $89,000, 1,159 square feet, three bedrooms and two baths here. 
So, okay. The kitchen is really nice. A sliding door. Um, not quite sure what this is. It says laundry chute. Oh, this is the laundry room. Okay. All right, all right. All right, and so this way, remember we came in through this door. If you go this way, you come right into the master bedroom. Huge closet. Let's see what this bathroom's talking about. It's so interesting how they like put the two together. Wow. But, oh wow, I was not expecting this stand-up shower situation in this one. Whew. Nice tub. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. I mean, like, look at all the storage you get. Insane. Here's some of the Bedrooms. This is one. Yeah, it is nice. It's another one. And then we have the bathroom. Okay, this tub is small. <laughs> Alrighty, oh, and where it was talking about laundry chute, you just throw your laundry through there, I guess. All right, we're gonna head out of here and go to the next one. Oh, I know, I am sweating. Ooh, hoo -hoo. okay, you guys. I love the door. This is the type of door that I love. It's so cute. And they have a new camera on this one. I love this type of door. The shaker style door. Okay, let's see what this one is talking about, y'all. We are burning up here in Columbus, Georgia. The heat. It's different here. Oh! Okay. Now, I love a light over the island. That, to me, is awesome. Let me show you guys what's over here. Oh my gosh, the cabinets are really nice. This is a nice kitchen. Oh my gosh, look at the sink. It's a farmhouse stainless steel sink. I have seen these before. That's really fancy. Wow, look at, oh my gosh, you guys. This is adorable. Do you guys see this pantry door? It has like the mesh. That is so adorable. Does it slide? Oh, it opens. Oh my gosh, look at this pantry. That is nice. It's so farmhousey, you guys. I wish I could tell y'all the price on this one, but I don't see any paperwork. Oh, they have a little shiplap. This one seems updated because I noticed that the front door had the doorbell and now it has the smart um, ecosystem. Oh, oh my goodness. The shiplap is gorgeous, but this just caught my eye. If you guys remember in the last house, I was talking about like a mud room with cubbies and this has it already built in. That is so stinking cute. Oh my goodness. Here we have a little bathroom. There's a lot of wood tones going on and I don't necessarily mind that at all. It's really cute. One of the bedrooms. Another one of the bedrooms. 
And now let's go check out the master. Okay, here's the master. This is probably at least a king bed. Wow. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. I am impressed. My hair, if y'all see it, the humidity is, has taken my hair over. That's how hot it is right here. But it has its own personal shower, toilet, and closet space. It is humongous. Wait, oh my gosh, it just keeps going around the corner. That is insane. Wow, I'm really impressed with this one. It has like that shiplap, farmhousey feel. I wish we knew the price on this, but as soon as we find out, we will tell you. Now you guys, this is the one that I personally came to see. It is gorgeous. It's called the Lula May, and I'm about to take you guys in in just a second, but I wanna first off show you guys the um, the features. Like, they have a little metal roofing over the windows, which is really cute. And it has a deck. None of them had this type of patio. So, I'm excited to see what it's looking like on the inside. Let me show you guys around this way. Look at the lights. Oh! Okay, let's go in. Oh my gosh, if there ever was a form house, if there ever was a farm house, look at the lights. Oh my gosh, y'all. I'ma just be quiet so y'all can take this in. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Now this is a kitchen. This is a kitchen. Okay, look at the lights. Have another door here. I mean, I can't get over the ship lab. They really did that. Wow. Wow, this is beautiful. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Pantry. I mean, this is huge. Now the only thing I wish is that this had the cubbies and the mud room, like how the other one did. That would just set it off, but you could put some cubbies right here in this corner and that'll be just as cute. I'm too hyped. So I didn't tell y'all the price yet. Um, I'll come back and tell you. But it's $119,000 for this um, trailer. It has the updated technology, a little built-in right here. Okay, we see you. Little office nook. That's really adorable. Okay, a little bedroom. A lot of these um, homes have like the extra materials in here. Here's one of the bathrooms. Oh my gosh, and I love how it has the black hardware. White and black is like gonna be the theme for my house. Wow, this is nice. That was another bedroom. And look at the doors. Even the doors have like style and character and charm. They're trying to replicate, oh my goodness. Now this is the biggest master bedroom we done seen. It has a sliding barn door. Wait, they're not doing it justice. Let me show y'all. I mean, do you see this? Marcus, come get some Bebo for me. Oh, my, 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 my. Hey! This is yeah. nice, so. This master is a true master. I just imagine myself washing my hair, getting cute. Real tile, this is real tile. 
in the shower. And right over here, I love the double vanity. All that it's missing, in my opinion, are two like circular mirrors overhead. And instead of the recess lighting, or maybe in addition to the recess lighting, putting like one little pendant light in between the two mirrors, that would set it off. We have some more storage space on both sides. So one for your hubby and one for you, girl, or both for you, girl. This is so nice. And we can't forget about the commode. I personally would have liked for this to be a little bit more close in, but it's okay. It's still like a private area and you can put like some cute decorations right here. I'm impressed. What about you? Okay, you guys, so that concludes all of the mobile homes that we were able to see today. I numbered them and I gave you guys the price of each one. So in the comments down below, write which mobile home you like the best for the style and the price. And then also comment down below if you would ever consider living in a modular mobile home, okay? Like, let's get into it in the comments down below. I respond to everybody's comments, so come on, let's kiki. Have a good one, guys. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and like the video. Bye.